So in this tutorial, we'll try to understand how to plot the animated sine and cosine curve using for loop in MATLAB. Now the commands which we have used or the program that we have used over here is value of variable x. The function that we have used is a line stress function where the variable x will take the values linearly from 0 to 10. 1000 linear points will be there from 0 to 10. Now we'll take the for loop over here. Suppose we define variable k. So here k is taking from 2 to whatever the length of x is there. Suppose it is 1000. So it will take from 2 to 1000. Then y1 is the value for sine function. So it is sine x. y2 will be for cos x. Then we have to plot x and y1. So for example, the first value of x is 0. Then corresponding value of y1 will be sine 0. That is 0. Similarly, if x is 0, then y2 will be equal to cos 0. That is 1. So similarly, the for other values of x, correct, from 0 to 10 in 1000 linearly spaced values, correct, the plot will be drawn. Now this comet function, it is used, for example, x, y1, it will plot a graph of sine curve and comet x, y2 will draw a graph of cosine curve. And this comet function it is used for direction graph. So we'll get the direction how the actual function is drawn over here. If you don't use this comet, then it will be only two curves, linearly drawn curves will be there correct, for sine and cosine function. So let us see how the function, we'll run the function, we'll run this code, correct, and we'll see how the functions are getting plotted over here. So this is the sine curve. And this is the cosine curve, which is getting plotted over here. So in this way, we can plot the animated sine and cosine curve in MATLAB using the for loop.